There's something about the road. It gives you freedom, but it also reminds you how fragile things can be. One moment you're flying free, nothing but the open road ahead, and the next, everything changes in an instant. But that's the thing about riding. It's not just about the good moments. It's about knowing that no matter what happens, we'll get through it together. Because on the road, we trust each other and we trust the journey, even when the unexpected comes. We started the ride early that morning, no rain, just clear skies and excitement for the Charleston all-female ride. The sun was on our side and everything felt perfect, the kind of ride you dream of. But then, like life, the weather changed in an instant. DS1. Hey DS1. And uh we're in Florence. The um the rain is like on and off. So y'all know who that is. <laughs> That's my girl Sassy. So um yeah. DS1 taking lead this leg. So uh we about two hours from Charleston, but we're gonna pass Charleston because we're trying to get 500 miles. So uh so yeah. Check in when I get to Charleston. All right, you guys, I made it. Made it to the hotel. My girl's bikes are right there. And um, we checked in, but we're heading back out because we still need 30 more miles. We're doing a 500 mile challenge and we're at 473. So that's with us going backtracking 473. So we're doing 30 more miles. And then I can relax, hit the meet and greet and then go to sleep because rain makes me so sleepy. I was so wired this morning, but let's go. Walking to the gas station to get oh, woo, to get our last receipt. You good? Oh, okay, she good. Take that picture with the odometer, and then we can enjoy ourselves. Oh, Whole crew is here. I'm tired. Uh, I got the organizer of the South Carolina Charleston All Female Ride. So I'm Tamika, aka Risky, aka Queen. Everybody call me Queen. Risky. You want to tell us a little bit about your ride, like how it came to be? Well, to be honest with you, I have a nonprofit organization uh, for women of sexual and domestic abuse. And recently, since my son has passed from a gun accident, we've added um, uh, a foundation, DKB Foundation for Gun Safety and Training Awareness. So I've always been the one to love women, empowerment, pushing out sisters, my whole ministry is uplifting women. Yes. So, I think that's all right. We're going to bring them out. Period. And they out here, okay? <laughs> what you say? Period. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So y'all come out. Get bigger and better. Period. Okay? So y'all come out next yes. year and support. Yes. Next year and support. You can always um, donate to our, our foundation, our nonprofit. At Cash App, it's got Cash App, S C A F R. A F R is all female ride. So Cash App, dollar sign S C A F R if you want to donate to the cause. Thank you, baby. Thank you. All 
Alright y'all, we are at the South Carolina Charleston all-female ride. And um demonstration is right behind me. It's a rainy day, but they had a, a, a good turnout. All of the vendors are on this side. So they got their vendor lane. And it's hosted at Cycle Gear. So yeah, this is good. For it to be as rainy as it was this weekend with a hurricane coming through and women still came out to support, I think that's so dope. So they got the food, got the food truck. Tracy is doing her social butterfly thing. DS1 is here. <laughs> so yeah, this is dope. So let me show you guys who I just ran into. It's Miss Fearless. I was just telling her I've been friends. Ooh, that's a good picture. Shoot. Oh. Okay, let's try this again. So I just, oh, y'all messing up the video. This gotta be loud all the time. This gotta be seen all the time. Um, we about to get it. What time does the ride start? Okay, so the ride starts in 18, approximately minutes. So, the what? Glad you made it down here safe weather lady. <laughs> so she was keeping us she was keeping us updated on the weather in the Facebook in the Facebook group and she came in from Florida so she look at her. Hey, hey, energy on 10. I love it. I love it. parking lot and that was a good ride nice and fast <laughs> turn that throttle okay but yes we back we about to eat you know fellowship a little bit and then we gonna get right back to the room but it's crazy because the sun came out as we were pulling into the parking lot and you know it's always crazy with these rides because rain 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 and then boom as soon as you start the ride the rain goes away it's like, God just be like, I got you. At least for this little 30 minutes. And then we gonna drop it down on you. But it's it's beautiful outside. So, Charleston, good job, ladies. Y'all did that. Charleston wasn't just a destination. It was a celebration a chance for all of us to connect, ride, and share stories, old friends, and new faces. The thing about life is that it can change in an instant. As we left the Charleston all-female ride, on an on-ramp to get onto the highway, I saw sparks in my mirror and my heart dropped. My sister was tumbling down the highway. My sister had just gone down. All I knew in that moment was that I had to run. I pulled over, threw my helmet to the side of the road, and ran to my sister. My girl Chantel was already on the phone with the police, and I kept telling my sister, stay still, don't move, are you okay? Because I needed to hear her voice. My girl Faya controlled traffic and made sure that the cars went around us. Once the paramedics arrived, Tracy followed the ambulance to the hospital, and I stayed with the bike to make sure everything was taken care of. We found out later that an oil slick caused the fall. It was one of those things that could have happened to any of us. 
We spent hours at the hospital waiting, praying, and just trying to be there for one another. After my sister was discharged, I went to get her medicine and we knew that we had to get her home, but we weren't in it alone. In no time, two more of my sisters rode all the way from Hampton Roads to take my sister back home. There's just something about this road that just clears your mind. Like, when I got on the road this morning, I was not good. I was not good. Um, I saw a bike go down behind me yesterday. Um, and it's not my story to tell, so I'm not gonna say say her story, but I'm not good. <laughs> and uh, thank God for my sister. Thank God for my sisters. Cause, uh, but I will say, I left it all on the road today, so I feel much better than I did when I woke up this morning. So, thank God for favor. Oh, Whew. And as for my sister. Well, her resilience is something I have always admired about her. She had to have multiple surgeries on her ankle and she had lots of road rash, but she's here and that's what matters. We may not always know what's around the next bend, but we ride it out together. In life and in riding, it's not just the falls that define us, but how we rise from that fall. <laughs>